So today we're going to be focusing on manifesting a vision and setting a vision for 2022 and getting clear about that vision. So this is going to help you set goals and to get focused in what, you know, what you want to manifest. So find a comfortable area and let's get started. Close your eyes, fill your sit bones onto the seat and just begin to breathe in and out. Take a big breath in and a calming breath out. Again, a big breath in and a calming breath out. And just observe your breath, the rise and fall of your chest and the exhalation and feeling your feet relax and your ankles and your knees and your thighs and your pelvis relax, your abdomen, your stomach. And your torso, your shoulders relax, your elbows and your wrist, all relaxing. And just begin to become aware of your body and how you're feeling in this moment and how you're feeling after transitioning to the next year here and how your new year was and your holidays and just taking stock of your, your thoughts and your feelings and your behaviors and your actions around that time. And then how you're feeling right now. Are you feeling more tired than usual? Or are you feeling more energized? So just take stock of your feelings right now. If you're just joining us, we're doing our vision setting um, manifestation for the next year, 2022. This helps set your goals and helps set your intentions. So now that you're feeling more grounded in this moment, I want you to visualize a map. So see a map, and then I want you to see a country that has a lot of divisions, maybe like Africa has a lot of divisions in the country and lines, really geographic lines. So I want you to see 2021 as one state and then 2022 as another state. So two different states next to each other. And I want you to, to envision a tunnel between those two places, a long tunnel. And your tunnel can look various ways. It can have colors. It can just be pretty bland, you know, just a simple tunnel. And I want you to see yourself crossing over into this uh, from 2021 to 2022. But while you're crossing over, I want you to see yourself in the tunnel. And I want you to see yourself shedding layers, much like a reptile, like a snake would shed or a crab sheds its exoskeleton, you are shedding your layers of what you want to release, what you want to release in to back to 2021, what you want to keep there in this last year. So if you struggled with anger, resentment, pride, self, self-loathing, you know, things that stood in your way, this is your time to just let it shed, visualize yourself shedding it off of you and letting it fall out in, into the tunnel, into not, not coming into 2022. So just see yourself shedding those layers, every layer just shed as you walk through, keep walking through, it's a very long tunnel. As you walk through, walk through, walk through that tunnel and then see yourself now stepping into 2022. And what do you wanna bring with you? What new layers do you want to have? So you're getting, you're getting a new, um, 
um, uh, armor to protect you, right? So you shed the last armor and now you have a new armor. So what are those new attributes that you have? So you can say to yourself, I want to have more confidence. I want to bring in more abundance. I want to, you know, bring in, so you're stepping into 2022 and now you're here and you have all this new stuff with you and you've let go of all that stuff that held you back. And now that you're here, think of one word, one word that you want to bring into this year. So one word that you want to bring into this year you could bring, bring it into your, bring it into your work, bring it into your relationship. What's one word that you want to bring into this year? And just meditate on that word for just a moment. Some words that people have been saying are slowing down, joy, peace, contentment, relaxation, connectedness. What, are the, what does that word look like for you? And now that you've also stepped into this new place in this new new um, um, year, you also want to set a vision for yourself, right? A vision of you achieving the goals that you are setting out for yourself. So I want you to see your goal, see yourself doing the action of that goal. So see yourself. If your vision is to write a book, I want you to see yourself writing the book. If your vision is to increase your sales, so I want you to see yourself doing that. If your vision is to have a new relationship, I want you to see yourself that, or to get a new car, a new house, whatever it is, set yourself and see yourself in that moment, doing those things in that moment. Actually see yourself doing those things that you're setting out for your vision. So notice the what's around you when you're creating that vision. What are you wearing? What are you wearing in that moment that you're creating that vision? What are the sounds? Do you hear any sounds around you? What's around you? Where are you? Where are you sitting? The more tangible you can get about your vision, the more that you can create that reality. So get get like fine tune the details of that vision for yourself. Fine tune the details of that vision for yourself. To see yourself doing those things, continuing to do those things. So, if your vision is to take more vacation time, maybe you see yourself on a beach. Maybe if it's to slow down, so you see yourself slowing down. So just see yourself, if it's more new clients, see all those clients around you, see the clients. And now that you're here in 2022, the tunnel is still existing between 2021, 2022, and you still have your layers. So they didn't go away. They just are evolving, right? So you still might have some character defects that come up such as anger, resentment, jealousy, self-loathing, things like this, self-centeredness. That's totally normal. It's just how you interact with them that is the most important thing. 
So even though we're saying goodbye to some of those things, we will not completely shut the door on them, but we know how to be aware of the action now, be aware of the feeling through meditation, through awareness and mindfulness. And maybe your 2022 is just to become more mindful of your thoughts and your feelings and your emotions. Again, coming back to that word that we said in our mind's eye, and does that word still resonate with you right now? So if you, if your mind begins to wander again, coming back to that word or coming back to that vision, that's what we're meditating on right now. So coming back to that word, coming back to that vision, keeping that vision so laser focused. So when you start to get distracted, you can always come back to that vision for yourself, always coming back to what you would like to manifest what your vision is for this year. See yourself in that vision. See yourself doing it. And then the last thing is, how does it feel to have accomplished that vision, that goal? How does it feel? How does it make you feel inside? Do you feel happy? Do you feel accomplished? Do you feel satisfied? If you accomplish that, will you, will you be satisfied or do you just want more? Do you have a more, more intention, more manifestation, right? So maybe this is just a step to get to a bigger goal. And what that bigger goal is, maybe it will be revealed in time, but you have to first do this first step. And feeling your whole body relax, your mind relax, your vision nice and strong. Allow your torso, your pelvis, your thighs, your knees, your calves, your toes, everything coming back awake again. Wiggle your fingers, wiggle your toes, wiggle your shoulders. Take a big breath in and, and open up your eyes. Okay. So what I would like you guys to do is 